And here's the lineup for Rangers. Well, the two central midfield players need to have a different skill set. The holding midfield player has to be good defensively, whereas the player at the top of the diamond has to be expansive with his passing and be the team's creative spark. So the starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Jordan Henderson starts with Naby Keita in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Alfredo Morelos. Can he find the right pass? Might jump in front. Keeper did his job to begin with. And in at the second time of asking. Just what was required. Well, let's take another look at this. And from the attacking point of view, everything's right. The shot across the goalkeeper, players coming in for the rebound, and there's not much the goalkeeper could do about that. He made a good effort on the first one, couldn't react to the second. Well, the travelling fans will be hoping for a much better performance tonight. You'd expect that they might bounce back after what can only be described as a disappointing showing so far in the group stage. Well, I'm surprised how poor they've... Oh, a goal for Liverpool, who are now on level terms. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. Well, they might be onto something. Mo Salah. And a goal! Another one! Two in quick succession! No wonder they're celebrating! Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And then the strike from Salah is absolutely devastating. The keeper just couldn't react to the power of the shot. What a goal that is! Well, those stats don't lie. Liverpool haven't controlled the ball, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been... Oh, wait a minute. They could well be in. Well, it's all going so swimmingly for them here. Another goal. And now it's a matter of avoiding any silly mistakes. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Salah. Opportunity it is. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, as you can see, the defending is all over the place. That's far too easy for the attackers. The goalkeeper's got absolutely no chance there. Konstantinos Simikas. Here's Keita. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display.
Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. Naby Keita. There's a slide draw pass. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And what a strike by Firmino. He hits it so sweetly. That's a top class goal. And space here on the flank. That's a great stop. The sound of the referee's whistle. This match is in the history books and it goes down as a Liverpool victory. Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.